Hey everybody, it's time to play. My latest Misfits Market Basket box had some Brussels sprouts, which I have cleaned and halved, and some gnocchi, and some roasted red peppers, and some bacon ends and pieces that I already cooked and crumbled. Also some, this is Habardi cheese, and we are gonna make something really fun. We're going to make a bacon, Brussels sprouts, and gnocchi dish with a roasted red pepper cream sauce. Follow along, it's gonna be great. We're starting our Brussels sprouts with some melted bacon fat, and now we're going to saute some uh, garlic and some onion, which we are going to season with some salt and pepper, and a little bit of dried basil. and a little bit of dried oregano. And cook that down till it softens up just a little bit. And then we're gonna add in our Brussels sprouts. Our Brussels sprouts are in. I have put them cut side down because I want them to get crispy. So I'm just gonna leave them alone and let them cook for a while, not stir them. To make this go a little faster, I'm gonna put a cover over here. And I'm, like I say, I'm just gonna let them go, let them brown up on the cut side. Look how bright green these are getting and they're starting to soften up nicely. And for a little tang for our dish, I am going to splash this with some white balsamic vinegar and deglaze that pan. And when these are just slightly more soft, we're going to take them out and we're going to make our sauce and we're going to finish our dish. While our Brussels sprouts finish up, we are going to add our roasted red peppers to this container so we can use the immersion blender on them. Now this, if these were homemade roasted red peppers and had no oil, I would cook them in with the oil that's in the pan already, but these came packed in oil. And so we're just gonna puree them up with their existing oil. Immersion blender's in. We're now going to remove our Brussels sprouts from our pan. Try to leave as much as the, of, of the onion and stuff. Anyway, see how nice and brown they are on, this, on the cut side? That's gonna be so good. Okay, now in goes our roasted red pepper puree, as much as we can get in there. Incorporate that with the seasonings, onions, garlic, and salt, pepper, salt, pepper, basil, oregano. Talk much. And then we're gonna add in some half and half. In we go. Stir that up. Let's see if we got enough. We might need some more. And we did. We're gonna let this simmer a bit until it thickens up and becomes the right consistency. Okay, our sauce is warming up nicely. Look how beautiful and pink that is. Now we're gonna cheese it up. As I mentioned, this is some shredded Havarti that came from Misfits Market. And that's gonna be melty and creamy and so delicious. Okay, our sauce is ready. Now, the gnocchi that I have is in a very small package so I'm going to transfer the sauce to back into its container and I'm going to save some of the Brussels sprouts and some of the other stuff. And we're going to do a second incarnation with these ingredients on flatbread Friday. I've cooked our gnocchi and I have also tossed it with a little bit of roasted garlic oil just to keep it from sticking together. And that's going in. along with our bacon, some of it. And some Brussels sprouts. And finally, our creamy, cheesy, roasted red pepper sauce. And we're going to toss that all together and we're going to devour it. 
they're getting all mixed up nice. It's green, it's pink, it's creamy, it's white gnocchis, it's little bits of brown, and next thing we're gonna do is plate it and serve. Here we have it, our Brussels sprouts, bacon, and gnocchi with a roasted red pepper and Havarti cream sauce, and it's yummy. We're gonna plate it up and see how pretty it looks. And here's our close up. It is, like I say, it's green, it's pink, it's flecked with brown bits, and it's very, very good. So let's take a bite. Here we are, a nice browned Brussels sprout, a nice creamy, drippy gnocchi, <laughs> and in it goes. Thank you for joining me today while we played with my Misfits Market Box. It was lots of fun and so delicious. And